Hey guys, what's going on? This is um, Eric Broadus and welcome again to my YouTube channel, Eric Broadus YouTube. I say welcome again and happy Friday, guys. I hope that you had um, a good um, week, you know, as I have. And when I say guys, I'm talking about ladies too. But anyway, on um, this video, I'm briefly going to cover some more military content, which is covering um, a series of higher tenure in the military. And today, I will briefly go over what the higher tenure is for active duty Air Force personnel and also um, reserve members and National Guard. So this is going to be brief and real quick because I'm going to um, come back with other videos um, for the other branches of service as well. Last um, weekend I did the high year tenure for the United States Marine Corps. Or the, yes, the United States Marine Corps. So. Um, this week um, it is the United States Air Force so um, here we go con pertaining to the guidelines of high year tenure and for those of you that may not have seen last weekend's video or don't know what high year tenure is basically high year tenure is a set time in the um, armed forces that um, they give members to be able to um, remain in a certain grade or rank before you have to be promoted or um, you have to um, separate or you would be um, basically um, discharged because you didn't um, promote. So in each grade, you have a certain time limit in which you have to get promoted. And then once you hit the grades for like sergeant um, and above, and this is just the enlistment I'm covering right now, which is basically once you get to like um, E4, that is when... Um, um, you have so many times to get passed over for promotion and before if you if you don't make promotion within a certain number of times then um, you'll be involuntarily separated or administratively um, discharged but anyway this is um, the guidelines and how your tenure for um, active duty Air Force and Air Force Reserve and National Guard okay in the rank of um, E4 which in the Air Force E-4 is a senior airman. Um, the high year tenure is eight years. Um, in the grade of E-5, which is the rank of staff sergeant, the high year tenure is a 15 year arm um, limit. In the grade of E-6, which is technical sergeant, the high year tenure is 22 years. Now, let me explain something. Um, in the um, Air Force and pretty much most military branches um, 20 years is the limit is the beginning of, of when you can retire that's the earliest that you can retire so um, basically for in um, for an E6 you know they have the option obviously to retire at 20 or to go the extra year or two okay so just a, a quick side note, in any branch of service, 20 years is the earliest that you may be able to um, retire for full, you know, retirement from active duty. Now, there are obviously other exceptions, such as a mili the, the military can retire you medically in, in, in other cases because maybe you had a, a, a certain type of um, injury or something like that, you know, on duty where you can no longer continue in your commitment to the military. So they will medically retire you that way and I don't know if you what the um, um, you know what the exact rules are how they factor that out as to how much retirement and how much money you'll get and that's a whole nother um, video right there but for E6 technical sergeant high year tenure is 22 years um, for the grade of E7 which is a master sergeant high year tenure is 26 years and then next up are the grades of senior master sergeant or the the rank is senior master sergeant but the grade is E8 high year tenure is 28 years and then lastly is the grade of E9 which is the rank of chief master sergeant in the Air Force which is 30 years now um, under certain exceptions if you have say a chief master sergeant of the Air Force meaning that he's above all the other um, E9s if they're working like um, under special duties like under a certain command or maybe for the Joint Chiefs of Staff, they may be allowed to extend um, like an extra year and retire at um, 31 years, but that is just, that's the exception. But um, this video is um, basically short 
and brief and to the point. As I stated before, that all branches of service in terms of promotion and stuff like that is it is competitive and um, no branch in the military wants personnel to remain stagnant. They want um, individuals to remain on the cutting edge and those that are going to um, promote and keep their skills ready, you know, so um, they constantly are trying to um, filter out and push for the cream of the crop. So it's, this is not an um, a institution where you can just sit there and, you know, remain at a certain grade forever. That I've always called the um, armed forces, it's a, a young man's um, military, you know, it's a young man's military. You know, you ain't going to find any 80 year olds <laughs> pretty much at any rank, you know, serving in the military. Um, they want, you know, what I'm saying um, youth and maybe, um, you know, go up to like maybe the middle age. And even for officers, um, if you have to really make it to the higher grades, you might can go up to like maybe early 60s or something like that. But um, that's not really the norm with the military. But anyway. Um, that's my take on it. But again, this um, video, the name of it was um, High Year Tenure, United States Air Force. And this is for Active Duty Air Force and for Reserve and National Guard. And so I will um, be back with um, some other videos with the other branch of service of High Year Tenure. But the name of my um, um, channel is Eric Broadus YouTube. That's E R I C B R O A D. US YouTube or Eric brought us youtube.com so please um subscribe to my YouTube channel um, smash the bell so you can be subscribed and get all future um, videos um, live streams and find anything that's going on with podcasts and also I have a, um, a podcast um, called snacks thoughts uh, that's s n a k z t h o u g h t s and snacks thoughts you can find me on um, Anchor, Spotify, Spreaker, um, Listen, SoundCloud, Apple Podcasts, iTunes, um, Radio PBM, and a host of other social um, media platforms and WordPress also, you know, if you want to hear it, you know, for the blogging. But please um, um, subscribe to Eric Broadus YouTube and also Snacks Thoughts. And please um, share my podcast and um, my channel. Push it out. You know, and thank you to all my subscribers and all the people that have listened and joined me. And I will be coming out with um, uh, more content, not just military, but I'm going to start digging. I have some some topics that I want to um, hit on, and I think that they're quite interesting. So please, um, please join me. But share Snacks Thoughts and every brought us YouTube. Share them with your um, family, friends, um, enemies, frenemies, associates, co-workers. Um, cats, dogs, roaches, rats, bats, goats, possums, and whatever. All right, guys, have a good Friday and have a good weekend. Peace.